Is the sound okay? I did throw a BGM over this and I did test beforehand and it sounded alright, but it could be fucking with me. Hi, hi, hi. Welcome. Alright, cool. Good to know. So, um, we're gonna be playing Fuck Mary Kill today. Um, just because I think it would be funny. <laughs> okay, cool. Yeah, I tested a little bit beforehand in a recording, but sometimes it sounds fine in recording and not fine on stream, so gotta make sure. Um, we're gonna be playing Fuck, Mary Kill today. Um, sometime between now and, uh, sometime between the last five minutes, I went from 29 responses to 32, so I think I might actually close the form. Um, I wasn't actually expecting as many responses as I got, but uh, my friends are reliable, so thank you. I'm also curious what people submitted because I don't know what any of these are. Um, <laughs> I did not screen these beforehand. I did not look at them, period, so it is a mystery to me what people have put, and I'm actually a little bit scared because if you know me very well, um, this is a psychological horror stream. <laughs> so, um, yeah, let's, uh, take a look, I guess. Um... Oh god, it's summary, question, individual, individual responses, what I wanted. Um, I'm not going to show, like, the form itself on screen, I think, but if you want proof this is something somebody sent in, I will take a screenshot, bit, screenshot and, <laughs> uh, you know, I'm just preparing myself for, for doom. <laughs> It'll be useful, I think, in the future. 
Aria is uh, also still in here, but I think I have to resize for her because her sprites are a little bit bigger. All of these ones I made at the same time, though. Okay, so let's let's take a look. So the first one, the characters are Lulu from Final Fantasy X, Yor from Spy Family, and Sailor Jupiter, or yeah, Sailor Jupiter from Sailor Moon. I'm going to say I'm actually kind of surprised that this one is uh, all female characters. Because I feel like when people think of me, they tend to think of male characters first. <laughs> um, hmm. Mm. <laughs> Let me go grab icons for this while I think about it. These are all characters that I like a lot. Actually, I don't think I've ever mentioned liking Lulu Final Fantasy X. Oh wait, I don't want the publisher of Lulu. Um, <laughs> I don't think I've ever mentioned liking Lulu Final Fantasy X to like anybody that knows me currently. So that's very curious. She is a woman though. I love her. She might just be on brand, I think. Oh, right, this is transparent. That's fine. Edit, copy. So we have. Oh, wait. Do I need to zoom this in a little bit? Maybe I should have made the icons bigger. Yeah, we'll be fine. So we have Lulu. I'm not gonna put her into any specific category yet. It's true, I do love big titties. Big male titties, big female titties. All good. I do love your spy family also. She's great. Maybe the secret is black hair, red eyes. JK. Oops. Oh god, this is so gigantic. I should have probably screened it so I could make the icons beforehand, but it's fine, probably. Because I'm just googling images and taking like the first one or two things that I see. Lulu, your and then... It's not drunk, your. Your does have big tits. You just can't tell because they never fan service her, which is fantastic, and I love that for her. It's like you're from the first episode we meet her, where she's like killing dudes. I say like that hasn't been this entire last arc of um, <laughs> Spy Fam. Okay. Uh, oh my god. Ugh. All right. I would say to do both. I think both are a good time. The manga actually wrapped up an arc recently, so it's a good time to catch up. But the new, but the cruise ship arc is in the anime right now, and they put their entire effort into making your look very, very good, among other things. I want to know what the budget is for the Spy Fam anime. <laughs> okay. Um. Hmm. I will say that. For this selection of characters, I actually have the least amount of attachment to anything having to do with Sailor Moon. Um, I was like a card-captor Sakura girl, so... 
I do like Sailor Jupiter, but um, she's gonna have to be the first up on my kill section. I'm sorry. She's a good girl. But, uh, yeah. The other two are actually parents, so I can't do this to them. <laughs> One of these would make Anya sad and the other one um, is ingrained in my psyche as a child. <laughs> uh... Hmm... <laughs> actually label these so I'm not <laughs> yeah the stream is gonna be a lot we're going to learn a lot about me specifically this stream um This is a tough decision. The only reason I wouldn't marry Yora is because she can't cook, and I don't want to die from unintentional assassination. That's all. That's the only reason why I wouldn't marry Yora over Lily. <laughs> okay. I know she would be a good wife, but... Yours great. I love her. But I would never let her into the kitchen. <laughs> Self-preservation. Um, okay. So on to group two. What is this? Hold on. <laughs> this is such a group of characters and none of them are actually my type. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, so... Yeah, I don't think I want Yuri as my brother-in-law. <laughs> Basing your choices on that is not... no. Did I already fuck them? I think is a valid category to judge on. <laughs> okay. I think I know who sent in this um, form, and it's not somebody who knows anybody currently in chat, but the first person they gave me is Gepard from Honkai Star Rail, um, who is, I think, the captain of the knights. And then... The next one, I will show you guys as I copy-paste him into the screen. When fate exists, I think anything is possible for options. I, I know exactly who sent this one. I'm not going to lie to you for group two. The second person is Dainsleeve? from Genshin Impact. I know who sent this because this is all of my friends' favorites. <laughs> you know, that's fair because they look exactly alike. Um, And you're gonna be shocked, but the third character is in fact the Fire Emblem guy. <laughs> Because I was too busy laughing at this 
and mulling over my life choices. <laughs> These are the same man. <laughs> Hi, Zero. Oh, okay. Hold on. Let me think about this. Um, I'm just gonna say straight up, I would marry Gapard out of the this entire group. I would marry a part. I'm sorry. That's between all of these people, the part is the only normal guy here. Um. Oops. This is still in screen. Oh, it's a little bit out of screen. Yeah, the last two is the same guy. Um, normal guy. Hi! Hi, Ichi! Oh my god. Okay, hold on. So, between Dineslave and Dimitri. Um... <laughs> Thank you. No, they both have eye patch thingies. Dane, Dane sleeves is kind of more like a mask thing. Um, I'd have to grab a better picture. I think... I think between these two, I would kill Dane sleeve because I think he wants that. Um... If you play Genshin, I think he wants that. And then I guess I would fuck Dimitri. I think he also needs that. He might not want it, but... Um, <laughs> I think he needs it. <laughs> He's so sad. Dimitri, I think, needs a hug more than he needs to be fucked, though. Like, a good railing will not fix him. I think therapy will fix him. He does not need me in his life. <laughs> oh my god. They do a perfect vision between them. <laughs> Also, yes, kind of like Thancred. Um, let me see if I can get a better picture of Dainsleaf for for clarification purposes. Uh, yeah, this is more like a mask thingy. Copy image. I'll just delete this one after. Yeah, see? <laughs> yeah. It's more like Thancred, Heaven's Word Thancred y than anything else. Okay. So that is group two. He's got problems. This is not therapy, Mary Kill. I cannot help him. <laughs> that is not what I went to school for. Okay, um, group three. Oh, this is also an interesting... No, I did not go to school for fuck. That would be an interesting major, I'm sure. I went to school for international relations. The more you know. Okay, so... This one... People are sending in very interesting, uh, things. So we're on group three. So far we have not hit any characters I was expecting people to send in, except for your, by the way. Don't put it in quotation marks. It is a political field. <laughs> okay. Well, I didn't major in intergalactic relations, Wyndham. <laughs> okay, 
So the first person in this list is the third fleet master from Monster Hunter World, who I do like a lot, actually. When I was playing Monster Hunter World and I saw her, I was like, damn, hi! Um... <laughs> okay, so into group three. I don't know who sent this one, by the way. I know who sent the last one, <laughs> but this one is, uh, okay, somebody. <laughs> okay, um, and then the second person on this one is also an interesting pick. And it is Ada Long from Resident Evil 4. I also like her, but I don't remember anything about Resident Evil, so this is purely like a vibes thing. You know, long. If you hear my loud ass keyboard, it's because I'm labeling my layers, so I don't. I don't, um. <laughs> drag the wrong thing around. Okay, let's see. And then the last one, I have so many pictures I can pick from for this one. TBH. If he sent in this one, I try, I would have been surprised, but I, I could tell from the like rest of the characters after when I read this that this was not you. <laughs> it's Bayonetta, and I'm going to use um her second game design for the icon because that's the one that I like the best. This is a genre of women, by the way. This is a very specific genre of women. This does feel like a butt pick, I think, and I almost typed that instead of Bayonetta on the layer file because you should not type while speaking. Um, <laughs> Yeah, basically, but <laughs> Okay, um... Hmm. I feel like I would not succeed in killing Bayonetta. I'm just gonna say that now. I do think for the other two, the likelihood is higher that I would be able to do this. Um, I'm just gonna slide Bayonetta up here though. Anyway. <laughs> um, I guess purely based off of the fact that I know one of these characters better than the other, this is how I'm gonna shake this one out. Yeah. I think this is who I would be able to kill, marry, or fuck. Um, <laughs> and also probably what this shakes out to, because, um... Bayonetta's got a girlfriend. It's fine. <laughs> Third Fleet Master, though, hit me up. And, uh, Ada Long's cool. I... She's a night she's a really cool lady, but um I know her the least out of all of these characters. <laughs> so um but if you sent that in, I'm sorry. Very sorry. <laughs> oh, this one is actually characters I was expecting to see. Um I could hear her saying that. It's cool. I knew one of them had to die. <laughs> I can hear that word for word in her voice. Okay, so this next one are all Honkai Star Rail characters, um, which makes sense because that is half of my brain rot at the moment. That's not 14 related. 
Okay. So the first character on this is... Oh wait, did it not copy? Copy. First character is Jinyuan, who is uh, my favorite character in Star Rail. Just saying. I love him. <laughs> okay, um, edit, copy, and then, so, Jinyeon. And then the second character is actually his teacher, <coughs> uh, Jingyu. Let me find a picture of her without her blindfold on. That might be better for this. Or maybe I should just use a blindfold, because all of the bigger pictures are like that. Yeah, I'll just use a blindfold. She came out sort of recently. She's very fun to play. I also love her. She would kill me though. Um <laughs> Just saying that I would die, but... <laughs> okay, Ching Liu, and then the last person on this is... Kafka from Star Rail, and I need to type Star Rail, otherwise I will get, um, probably not her. <laughs> She is not in armor, no. She's in a dress. There is yet to be a hot lady knight in uh, a star rail, actually. The most recent character is a red-headed male knight, though he reminds me a lot of Aoidos from Grand Blue Fantasy, and I thought about rolling. Okay. <clears throat> In Kafka. Um, okay. Oh shit, I didn't put them into their own folder. Whoops! Okay. Um, while I'm thinking about it. So I would definitely marry Jing Yuan. I'm, I'm just saying. This is Jing Liu's. Okay. And... I would marry Jing Yuan. He's maybe I'll actually get to take a nap for once because he's always he's very sleepy. I might be more inclined to take a nap if uh <laughs> Don't worry about it. Might be inclined to, you know, take a nap if, um, my partner is also taking a nap, you know what I mean? <laughs> they are nice and comfy. Maybe I should also get nice and comfy. Okay, I'll stop shaking though. Um, hmm. I don't really want to kill either of these two. <laughs> Um, <laughs> uh, hmm. <laughs> I guess, I guess I would fuck Kafka because I think I could reliably count on her to leave it as a one time thing and not make anything of it. Whereas Jingli is a little bit mentally unstable. I'm sorry, it's true. Um, <laughs> I don't know what's gonna happen. 
when she is, uh, most unstable. <laughs> yeah, that, that looks right, I think. I might come back to this one and think about it. A little distressing to pick. Yeah, I'm not into knife play. <laughs> Yes, the one with the glowing pink eyes and villain lighting is in fact the more mentally stable of the two. Despite what it looks like, this is correct. <laughs> oh yeah, she's great. Kafka is so good. <laughs> okay, um, let's see. So we are on group five. And I will surely remember to make a folder because I'm talking about it this time. <laughs> Handshake emoji. Zero. <laughs> My only hope. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> grab the image for this before I start going. This one's gonna be better to, I think, unveil as I make the icons. <laughs> um, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Who did this? Uh, where is a good image of this character? Jesus. I know they exist. I'm gonna have to open up an image myself, aren't I? It's fine. I have one. I have one for this character. This is the only picture of them that I have. The first character on this is Emi Ashiro. And this is the only picture of him I have on my computer. <laughs> it keeps going from here, by the way. So. Oh my god. Fucking. I should have read these beforehand, but this is actually so funny. <laughs> so, the first character on this is Shiro. Yep. Oh boy. Okay. I'm gonna fucking lose my mind, I think. There are better pictures of this man than this. Hold up. He is a perfect house husband, it's true, it's true. This wasn't you? This is the exact kind of thing I would have expected you to send in, Zero. Close this one. No, I don't wanna. Didn't do anything to that. Okay. The second character is Muramasa <laughs> from Grand Order. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> We're gonna need to lie down after this stream, I think. It is and isn't the same man. <laughs> it's, yeah, it, it's fate logic in which all of these are, like, the, both of these guys so far are the same person, but not, like, quite. Much like the next guy. Um... The last person in this list is Archer Emia. <laughs> who sent this? I want to know who put this in my form. <laughs> I didn't make a, a sprite for 
me fucking losing it laughing because I didn't think I was gonna get something like this. <laughs> Someone extremely Emmy up. <laughs> oh god, I'm fucking crying. <laughs> anyway, I actually have an immediate answer for this. Moving on. <laughs> they have very different personalities. They're all very distinct. <laughs> it's what Archer wants! <laughs> well, it's only half of what he wants, but it's what he wants! <laughs> I can't kill Muramasa because I've been trying to get him for several years. I still do not have him in Grand Order. Also, yeah, Shiro is the house husband. Shiro's a perfect house husband. Technically, listen, hear me out. Technically, Archer is a better house husband than Shiro is, but... He's some fucked up version of suicidal, and that's all I'm gonna say on the matter. I have not been doing my logins on NA because I am terrible about doing my NA logins, and maybe I should do that with the volume muted. Yeah, I mean, Shiro's really traumatized too, but, like, hear me out. He, he tends to keep it all in his brain, so it's fine sometimes. Whoever sent in this one, by the way, is um, rude. And probably somebody that I... I can't even take a guess who this is. It's supposed to be somebody who plays Grand Blue, though. <laughs> this is rude. I should not have typed that name without adding the qualifier as to what. That was a bad decision on my part. <laughs> oh god, where... Yeah, the saying that I needed to put a qualifier is a pretty good giveaway as to who this is. <laughs> image, image, image. Okay. This is going to come up with a black background because this is transparent, probably. Select, deselect. So the first person on this is Lucifer from Grand Blue Fantasy. Whoever sent in this, I'm going to be coming for you. Sleep with one eye open. Um. <laughs> No, not quite. The next one... Wyndham, you don't know anything about my taste in Grand Blue characters. There's no way this was you. Um... Is there only this image from? The fuck? I don't... want to use the other image, though. There are four images available for this character, and I don't want to use one of them. Um, I guess I have to, though, because those ones are higher quality. <clears throat> I'll let that load. My internet's going through it a little bit, I think. Sandalphon. And I just said it, but the third character on this is going to be Sandal Fun, who I also should have put a qualifier on. Uh-oh. Did you, Wyndham? Did you? Yeah, the only person in this that they didn't- oops. 
that they didn't uh, put was um, fucking Lucilius, who I would have killed. That man would have been dead. Why is it uploading like that? Okay, copy image. Second. It would have been funny if it was also Lucilius, but that would have been an easy K. Okay, edit, it paste. So we have Lucifer, Lucio, and then Sandalphon. I'm gonna use his Valentine's Day art for this actually, because his Valentine's art Valentine's Day art is really nice. Um God. <laughs> Like Lucio, I really wish that his ongoing legacy for in the fandom was not memes from the shark event. But so it goes. Oh god, okay. And last one is Sandy. person leave me any notes in the comments? Let's just say Lucifer is alive. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Whoever sent that, thanks I guess. Lucio, and then this one is Lucifer. Yeah, one day I'll get Grand Lucifer, a hundred years cope. Um, <clears throat> who is Sandalfon? Sandalfon is very cute. I love him. He's so good. He his whole thing is like, I guess now that he's settled down, uh, is just coffee and running a cafe in the corner of the airship. <laughs> Um, yeah, though, this is actually not that difficult. I think it's rude, but, uh, yeah, I would kill Lucio, sorry. I've been coping 5,000 years. Hi, Shadow! Good morning. Oh, wait, that's not... <laughs> I clicked the wrong name. Because unlike the last group, um, who have actually very distinct names, this group has two names that are very similar. And I skim read, so... <laughs> yeah, it's just, right now you can look at it in the columns and that is uh, about where it shakes out. <laughs> Sandal Sandalfon. Fun, fun, fun. Um, I have- okay, um, I would kill Archer because it's what he wants. And also the first person in the fuck category is Muramasa, and not Shiro. Okay. WHO SENT THIS?! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, this one's actually brutal. I need to think about this one. <laughs> be saying this a lot tonight, huh? Who sent this? I made an error not getting myself a hit list while I was doing this form, letting you guys do it completely anonymously. <laughs> um, is this one high quality picture? Oh wait, it opens up that. <clears throat> okay, I can do this. 
I think it's fair if you wouldn't kill Archer, but um, I'm also all about respecting people's wishes. <laughs> so the first person on this is Zhongli from Genshin Impact. All of the characters in this one are from different things, I want to clarify. I can't fix Archer. That's beyond me. <laughs> I wish you the best of luck. Oh my god, fuck, I forgot how loud Grand Order is. <laughs> you hear Grand Order noises in the distance. Um, no you don't. No, you do not. <laughs> okay, um... <clears throat> yeah. I think killing them on the basis of I can't fix them is valid and fair. All things considered. Can I... Oh wait, no, why does it bring it up like that? Honey. Yeah. Okay. And then the second person in this category is Siegfried from Grand Blue Fantasy. So, one day... I'll also get his grand if it ever comes out. <laughs> I'm just gonna open up my folder to um, get this last one because I have lots of pictures of this character. <laughs> and that is gonna be easier than um, googling a photo of them. Which photo though am I using? Hold on. <laughs> I don't know, I get scary when it's somebody I have lots of pictures of because it means I have uh, a problem. <clears throat> um, yeah, I'll use this one. That's fine. Open with Clip Studio. And the last character in this is Gilgamesh because someone out there does not love me. Um. <laughs> That, or, um, they love me a lot and know me too well, and I need to throw them out. For sending me this. Um, yeah, this is why I said when I read it that I need to think about this one. Let me think. <laughs> um. Hmm. Oh shit, I didn't put the sentence on folder again. My weakness organization. I briefly considered doing that, actually. Um, <laughs> but we're not going to... Okay, this is Siegfried's. And this one is Zhongli. This is hard. These are like all of my top favorites from the respective series. Every time I see that art, I think about the screenshotted stories of someone putting a padlock in someone's gauge here. Oh, why? Because of his earring? I mean, that airing is extremely obnoxious, that's fair, I suppose. <clears throat> like, everything else about him is obnoxious. That's- that's fair. Um... Uh... <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Hold on. I'm really thinking about this one. <laughs> Do you? 
Uh... <laughs> I think as much as I like Zhongli, I would just fuck him, yeah. He's as broke as I am, so we should not get married. Um... <laughs> I mean, you're right. You're right. You are right. Which is why, unfortunately, I do have to kill Gil. I'm just going to assume when people put Gilgamesh, they do not mean, like, Caster Gil, they mean Archer Gil, because there is a distinction in personality. Um... If this was Castor Gill, this would be a much harder choice about who to kill, I think. Because I'm like, e yeah, I, I would marry Castor Gill, I think. <laughs> I would at least be taken care of. Um, but yeah, I, I would marry Siegfried. Um, he's a knight. He's always out doing shit and traveling around, but he has a stable job. Thank you. I, I I feel like this a lot, so I thought this was a a suitable sprite to make for myself. <laughs> yeah, Castorgill is husband material, but um, Archer Gilgamesh, uh, kind of not, not it. <laughs> And he does deserve to die the most. He has, in fact, uh, I think died in just about every piece of fate media he's shown up in, too. So, uh, I guess this is just part of the course. Sorry, Gil. Looking away from the Gilgamesh plushies on my bookshelf. Anyway. <laughs> this was group seven? Oh my god. Okay. Have you managed to kill him? Yeah. What the? <laughs> what is that? I keep looking at these like, what the fuck? Okay, hold on. Um. So, the first one on this is Sherlock Holmes from Fate. Okay, this one I have a picture for, so that's. Easy grab. Get it. East. I love Holmes' uh, fate, by the way. <clears throat> He's such a good, like, iteration of Sherlock Holmes. And everybody should meet him, except he's trapped in Grand Order. Oh, wait, am I clicking the wrong button? Okay. Yeah! The steampunk corset is really good. I'm going to not lie to you guys, this one is actually going to be very easy for me. Um, because the second character in this is Bendy Dick Cumbersnatches. Um, Oops, what did I do? <laughs> Just fucking deleted him from into the void. Uh, okay. <laughs> Sherlock Holmes. Yes, they did. It says specifically Sherlock Holmes BBC TV series. <laughs> Who sent this one in? I gotta know. Um. Oh, did I not copy-paste the last one? I thought I did. Okay. Select, all, edit, copy. Mm, oh, no, I just made the folder. That's what I did. Got it. Okay. And the last one is... It is a little bit unhinged. I watched not very much of BBC Sherlock because I did not like him in that I thought it was a bad adaption of Sherlock Holmes. <laughs> I 
and that's all I'm going to say on it. I think if you really enjoyed um, BBC Sherlock, good for you. I'm glad you had fun. Also, the last one is Sher Sherlock Sholmes from The Great Ace Attorney. I wish this one was Robert Downey's uh, Sherlock Holmes because I actually really like those movies. Yeah. I think if you like it, that's fine. I don't particularly um, enjoy it. I just have issues with the writing. I'm sure that um, he he's a good actor. I'm sure he- oh wait, no, he is a good actor. I have seen him as Doctor Strange. I just completely forgot because I'm trying to put Marvel movies out of my brain. <clears throat> but yes, so the last one on this is, um, Sholmes. Um, this one is easy for me because it can only go one way. I'm sorry. I don't know much about Sholmes because I haven't played TGA yet, but I know that he has like a daughter type character um, and my friend loves him, so this is good enough. No, Fate Holmes is not husband material. Fate Holmes is a one night stand you don't talk about. <laughs> I love him, but this is the truth. You have to admit certain things about your favorite characters, and this is one of them. <laughs> Everett Sholmes is really good. Um, based off of his design, he's not a character I would pick, but I, I have heard good things about him as a character. Um, from a friend with reliable taste, so... <laughs> Listen, I will mock Mind Palace incessantly in Doctor Who, but a detective and his cinematic montage of deductive reasoning is a modern era trope, so I don't really care about it in a detective show. I think the Mind Palace is stupid. <laughs> I think the Mind Palace is stupid. <laughs> Okay, what are we on? Group 9? Okay. Oh, this one's fun. This one is very fun. <laughs> I'm actually really excited for this one, because I also had to think about this one a little bit. Um... Well, the, here's the difference. Robert Downey Jr. was a good Sherlock Holmes. Um, and the writing in those movies were good. BBC Sherlock Holmes is, uh, bad. <laughs> Personal opinion. Oops. Oh, why is it on this? Okay. So, group nine. Wow. I feel like... Okay. So for this one... The first character in it is Izanagi from Persona 4. Izanagi is the main, um, <clears throat> is the main, hold on, persona for the protagonist of P4. And the extra comment on this says, regardless of the MC they are attached to. So, you know, you got it, boss. Whatever you say. <laughs> you are not lauding the fucking brain blast in my chat right now. Get out.
Yes. We are not going to speak positively or implied positively about the fucking Jimmy Neutron brain blast. No, that was also bad. Jesus Christ. Yes, it's implied positively. <laughs> Hi, Misu! It's okay that you're late, don't worry about it. Yeah, please, like, look at this. It was, like, Muramasa, Shiro, Emiya, and then it was Sandalfon, like, Lucifer, Lucio. <laughs> and then otherwise is, uh, three versions of Sherlock, which was funny. Yeah, like, this is a very small picture of Orpheus. Hold up. The second one in this, though, is Orpheus Persona 3, which I'm not allowed to uh, judge with any kind of bias for this, I guess. Because it says, regardless of MC it is attached to. <laughs> I don't know what your contribution was, by the way, because this is all anonymous. So far, I've only guessed who... I think I've only guessed one submission accurately as to who this is. How dare you call Minato Arisato Persona 3 love of my life that one guy? Is this not paste? Are you not pasting? Okay, hold on. Edit. Paste. Here we go. And then the last one is Arsene, the persona for the MC of P5. This one's really good though, I was excited to see this one. <clears throat> yeah, I would be surprised if you don't know Arsene, he's places. Current cash cow. Um, oh god, I have to think about this. Okay, so design wise, I actually really, really like um, our sons and Izanagi's a lot more than I like Orpheus's. Yeah, this is for all the monstrous humanoid fuckers and also for me, major Persona fan. Oh god. It is gonna be a hard life being the wife of a phantom thief, but... They're not robots! They are distinctly not robots. Um... Oh god. Uh turn this this Izanagi. I think I put these all in order. <clears throat> you can bone anything if you're not a coward. I just wanna say. I'm not a monster fucker, but this is a true statement. Yeah. They are not robots. They are distinctly not robots. Let me close this tab with forms in it. Uh, oh god. Let me think. I like most of their designs, it's a thing. So if I'm going purely off of aesthetics, I do have to kill Orpheus, which feels bad. <laughs> Uh, I'm sorry, Renato. But I'm supposed to do this regardless of the MC they are attached to, so... Um... Mm. Damn, this is hard. <laughs> Jesus Christ, between Arsene and Izanagi... Uh... <laughs> I'm also sorry he has to be next to Bandersnatch. Um... Hmm. 
Uh, but if I think about it... Mm -hmm. Okay, I made a decision. Just live a difficult life married to a phantom thief. That's fine. <laughs> yes, you have to be traumatized and pilot a persona. It's part of it. Yeah, I think I think this is what I'm gonna go with for uh, the MC personas. Yeah, that was part of it. I was thinking about the mythology of it and how it ties in with the rest of the game, and I was just like, yeah. Let see, one, two, three, four, five. Alright. So... Does this make sense? Okay. <clears throat> so, this next one, I am like 99% sure I know who submitted this. Um, and I'm sure all of you will know in just a second. <laughs> Oh wait, I'm still Laku Laku. Hold on. Normal. Normal again. Yeah. I don't want to know what a mythological deity is going to do to me in a bad mood. Human criminal, I can just kind of walk away from. <laughs> so the first person in this next group is... Kiryu from the Yakuza series. He too was a great character. I'm sure you, half of you at least, know who sent this in already. Because um, I think I know. <laughs> this is group 10? Group 10. Why did I type group like that? Okay. You. And then this one also has a duplicate person, someone who showed up, uh, <laughs> yeah, like I said, you guys would know. And the second person in this group is, uh, also Archer. What is happening in my chat? <laughs> and the third person, let me, let me, let me look. I don't have any pictures of this man anymore. Um, <laughs> and these pictures I had of him weren't even for me. Oh, this one's a good picture of him though. Yeah, they weren't for me. They were for somebody else. In the same format in which I save links to send people after they watch an episode of something. Yeah, this is such a good, distinct image. You can absolutely tell immediately who it is. Um. <laughs> anyway, uh, the last person on this group is Sebastian from Black Butler. I did re used to read Black Butler. I dropped it um, a long time ago. My favorite was actually Charles Gray in Corruption Sushi. <laughs> okay, let me think about this. Um. Hmm. <laughs> You know, that's fair. I think I would also be Monkey Puppet reacting to this kind of thing. Oh god, I don't know who that is. I'm actually not familiar with Blood, Blood Plus. 
Oh yeah, let me think about this group of shadow mandated characters. <laughs> Kiryu is a good man, but he is... He is in... Yakuza. No, I see the energy. I do. I have to think, though. <laughs> One of these people is a demon. And the middle person is, um, Archer. <laughs> uh, let me think. Mm. The thing is, I either like these all of these characters or don't have a problem with them. <laughs> yeah, all of them could, you know, take care of me, but... I did already kill Archer once. You're right. I don't know. Depends on the demon. <laughs> Are they hot? <laughs> Can they cook? Do they come with real estate? Speaking of, there's a, a chat sim game that I will be playing, not this week, maybe next week, but uh, A Date With Death, I will be playing that because it comes out, I think, this weekend, but not not this weekend. Or, I'm not going to be playing it this weekend, I might play it next week. <clears throat> and that Grim Reaper comes with real estate, holy shit. Um, <laughs> uh, oh god. I think, I think I would fuck Kiryu. I don't know what goes on in the, in the newest game that came out, but like, anyway. Real estate is literal. If you come with a house, I'm considering. Three Kriyu was good, but when I look at Kriyu, I have to consider him as as a whole, right? Like if we were talking just about Yakuza Three Kriyu, I would marry him, I think, and um, decide who gets murdered between these two. <laughs> mm hmm. <laughs> like I, that's what I'm just saying. But now I have to decide who dies and who I'm marrying between these two. Which is more difficult than expected. God. <laughs> Don't apartment complex at me. <laughs> uh, uh. See, if we're talking about visuals, I would say Sebastian is more my type than Archer, but I actually know both of these characters. <laughs> yeah, it is a tough choice. Um, mm, mm. I'm gonna go with Mary Archer and kill Sebastian. So sorry. Killing my cringe middle school to early high school years with that. <coughs> anyway. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Sebastian was not my bias, but he was. He was in Kuroshitsuji. He was, in fact, the guy in Kuroshitsuji. Yeah, as soon as I saw Kiryu in this list, I was like, oh, Shadow sent this. <laughs> oh my god, women. Sorry. <laughs> uh, you know, I have lots of pictures of all of these characters, but they're not on this computer. They're on a hard drive. What? Oh my god, women. <laughs> Do 
Do I have pictures of them on this computer? I don't think I have very many. Um, oh no, that is a GIF. Okay, I have to actually search up some. Okay. <clears throat> so, all of the characters in this group are from Persona 3. I will start off saying that now. Which is a uh, fair thing to put in a fuck, Mary kill list for me. I'm going to be using an image of this character, which is distinctly not from Persona 3 itself, though, because um, it's pretty and I'm gay. So. <laughs> Yeah, I might do another one of these. Um, if I don't get through all of these tonight, I'll make a note at what I left off, off on, and then I'll also make another form. Okay, so... The first one on this list is Mitsuru Kirijo from Persona 3. She's so hot, dude. Um... <laughs> Oh my god, I love her. This image of her is not from Persona 3, it is from Persona 4 Ultimax, um, which is a fighting game. But I saw this one when I Google searched her, and I was like, yo. <laughs> yes, it is from Marina. A girl hot. I love of women. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, this is such a high quality picture. Holy shit. I might just save this one actually. No, why is it a WebP file? Evil. Okay. I'll deal with that later. <laughs> I'll keep it open in a tab. <laughs> oh, okay, this does paste. so I can zoom out so I can resize this properly. The next character is Yukari Takeba from P3. And this art is actually from the remake that's going to be happening. It's part of the promotional character art. This image is so huge. <laughs> there we go. Oh, it's so high quality! Sorry. <laughs> it's very big. Also, whoever made the WebP format is my mortal enemy. Um, I'll fight them in a parking lot. Oh god, I didn't make another folder again. <laughs> Keep doing that. Okay, let me do that real quick. Group. Oh my god, it's group 11. Okay. So that is Yukari and Mitsuru. This is from Mitsuru, it's really your race. Um, I put down money already for a pre-order for a reload, and uh, I have been slowly paying it off in person at GameStop for the last several months. <laughs> They are releasing it for PC, though, yeah. I am not going to play it on PC, but... Why would it be free? It's not going to be free. Okay, um... Oh, this is also huge, but it's not as huge as the last one. And the last character on this is Aegis, also from P3. I guess I said that like five times already. This, she is my robot wife and I love her so much. She's so good! <laughs> okay. This could have been worse, actually, but... Um... <laughs> I'm not gonna say how this could have been worse. <laughs> this one is a robot. Uh, 
Um, yeah, anyway, sorry. This is not because I dislike Ikari or anything, and I do have an answer for this one. But, um... <laughs> Hold on. I have to, like, kind of inch these up a little bit because I realize that I'm going to probably run out of space. I'm sorry! I'm sorry, I do like Yukari more now that I am not an angsty teenager. I have thought about this! <laughs> I have thought about this! A lot. I've been asked this before. <laughs> Moving on! <laughs> I'm so sorry, Yukari. <laughs> you don't deserve that. You really don't. Oh god, I don't know who any of these characters are in this one. I did say people can submit characters they don't know. I don't know, though, so... <clears throat> All of these characters are from Stargate, um, which I'm not familiar with. Stargate, uh... SG-1, apparently. Yeah. Um, this is a decision to send me, though. Does it matter which picture I pick of her? Who is this? Oh, did you send this in, Wyndham? Look, I did not watch a lot of, like, uh, live-action television as a child if it wasn't on this and the last one. Oh, I see. Okay, so the first one is Sam Carter. This is fine, is it? Sam Carter. Okay. And then the next one is Daniel Jackson. I have not seen this at all. <laughs> um, is there a specific like image of this guy you want me to use, Wyndham, that you can like DM me? Okay. There's like a couple of different looks here, so I just want to know which one exactly you want me to be using here. <laughs> I'm gonna search the last guy though. Um, so since I don't know any of these characters, uh, please understand that this is going to be based solely off of vibes and, uh, assumptions and prejudice. <laughs> like, my own personal, like, assumptions about characters who have this specific look. <clears throat> oh, you want me to use this image? Okay. Sounds good. Let me... So, let me deselect, otherwise it's gonna do weird things to it. Um, this one is Daniel Jackson, <clears throat> who I don't know. Somebody just came in at the front door and I'm going to guess that that is my auntie. Because it is too early for anybody else to be back. And ch -ch -ch, last person. Um, all these pictures look about the same, so I think it should be fine to just use whichever. <clears throat> and the last one is Cameron Mitchell. Oops, a little too far. 
I love not having to resize the picture. Okay. So I do not know any of these people. Like I said. I do not know them. And I'm so sorry if anything that I say is controversial. <clears throat> well, I asked Wyndham to send me a picture. Because there's two pictures, right? One of him with, like long hair like this and one with a uh, shorter hair for Daniel yeah <clears throat> so I was like which which one am I using <laughs> um okay vibes based uh wait no that's the wrong layer Based off of vibes, I'm marrying Sam. Please understand. Um, <laughs> uh, hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I didn't really start watching until later seasons. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've never seen of or I guess I've probably heard of it like in passing but I don't know anything about this at all <clears throat> um. hmm it's okay grandpa I understand that you are old. Let me think about this. <clears throat> um, I'm just trying to make sure I know which layer I'm on. Okay. Uh, let's go with this. I'm not going to explain this, but I feel this is correct. Okay. She spin-off series had a young Jason Momoa. Okay. I believe you. I'm just looking at this like who looks most like a character that I would probably enjoy watching. Yeah. Okay. Um. Hmm. Okay. What's the next one? We are on group thirteen, which has. Oh. Okay. Interesting. <clears throat> I might actually have pictures for all of these characters on hand. Let me. Let me. Let me take a look. They might all also be in the same image. <laughs> if this is a true statement. Um, let's see. And order. Or might not be. Depends on the picture I use. <clears throat> So the first character in this is Artoria Pendragon from Fate. Oh, hold on. Let me have some water. <laughs> Could hear my throat dying for a second. Um. I know I have pictures of her, but it's like, which one am I using? to sort my official folder better because there's like 10,000 pictures of Gilgamesh specifically in here. <laughs> Where is it? There's a specific image I know I have saved with all of these characters in it, but... Hmm. 
need to think. I think the meanest, like, submission so far was still the Jean-Louis Siegfried Gilgamesh one. I did think about it. I was like... I want to say reflexively that I'm going to kill Gilgamesh, which I ended up doing, but... Listen to me. <coughs> okay. So the first one is Artoria Pendragon, who is in the middle of this. Just like this picture. Um, I think I have a picture of the next person saved, but I might not, so it might be faster to Google search this one. This one I have to think about though, because I'm not actually familiar with them. This was faster than me searching my folders. Um, okay, hold on. Let me make the icon for Arturia first. <clears throat> I don't talk about her very much, but I do also like Arturia a lot. I just don't think about her as much. No, I'm doing them in order. I don't have help with these things, so I figured I would just let it be. And plus, I didn't want to have to like randomize it because otherwise I will end up reading it. Um, oops. And I wanted to react to the submissions live. Uh, which does result in things like me fucking losing my mind at Shiro, Shiro, and Shiro submissions, but... <laughs> and then... Oh, I have to resize this one. Archive from Tsukihime. I haven't actually played Tsukihime. Um, I will say that now. I'm sort of familiar with her through proxy. Yeah, I feel like the live reaction is better than me, like, trying to screen and, uh, whatnot. I figured I'm not, like, super big streamer or something. I'm so sorry if you hear background sounds right now. Somebody came back home. Um, <clears throat> but I figure I'm not a super big streamer or anything, so it should be fine. I figure my friends are generally pretty respectful of uh, things, so there shouldn't be any problem. Okay. And the last one is Ryogi Shiki from Kara no Kyokai. If you haven't watched it, um, go watch it. Content warnings are required for most of them, though. So sorry. <laughs> Let me resize this a little bit. I want more of her outfit in there. Yeah. <laughs> they are really good. So let me label these so I'm not guessing who I am looking, who I'm trying to drag around. Okay. <clears throat> Bunch of Type Moon lead ladies. And one of them I'm not familiar with. Not super familiar with, anyway. I want to be. There's going to be English Tsukihime soon ish enough. I don't remember when they're planning on releasing it, but they did announce English. I have to play Mahoyomi though, still. Oh no, not Mahoyomi. Mahoyo. <clears throat> not to be confused with Mihoyo, but... Um... This is kind of difficult. <laughs> All of them are really good, so I don't, like, actually want to, like, pick. Uh... Mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> uh, 
going to go with the easiest thing for me to think of, which is that I would marry Shiki. And I messed up the alignment on that earlier, but it's okay. Um, yeah. I would marry Shiki. Let's start that. Um... <laughs> Between Arukai and Saber, who would I fuck and who would I kill? <laughs> I know a lot about one and not the other, which is really what makes this hard. <laughs> uh... Hmm... <laughs> This is kind of just based off of bias, also off of familiar- from familiarity, but I will go with fuck Saber and kill Arukai. I don't think I would be successful in that endeavor, um, for full clarity, but yeah, that's- that's where I think this is at. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Also, another one I might revisit and think about. <laughs> Not the Mary category, but the other one. Uh. Jesus. No, I didn't randomize it at all. I would have had to have somebody else come and randomize it, and nobody helps me with my streams, so I, uh. I'm just doing these in order. It's also easier for me to keep track this way of what I'm going through. I know other people send in submissions, but these are also all like anonymous, so I don't know who sent in what. What is this? I'm not a monster fucker. Hold up. Um. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Alright, let me go find images first before I... Before I start making icons so we can fully address this. Is it a response? <laughs> Do you... Let me find a good image for this, because there's no way one doesn't exist. Uh... Yeah. Okay. What's one? I don't know who some of these are even, but... Okay. Yeah, that, that sounds right. This is also a monster. That's what I expected! <laughs> I'm not a monster fucker. Let's get that clear right now. God, I thought this was a monster hunter character for a second, but it's not. <laughs> uh, what is this last one? I don't know what this last one is either. Oh, I've seen this one before, at least. Okay. They're not Monster Hunter monsters, no. They're all different things. Alright. <laughs> yeah, having to just, like, stare at this screen while I'm like... What the fuck? <laughs> uh... Did it not copy? Copy. Uh, so the first one is, yes, the first one is Godzilla. Oh my god, stop. Okay. I'm gonna use this one. <laughs> this is such a wild, wild submission. I don't think about kaiju. I'm not a kaiju person. <laughs> I don't think about this at all. <laughs> uh, 
Um, the next one... Oh wait, maybe I should resize this one a little bit? Wyndham, um, these are wild, thank you. This one especially is wild. <laughs> this one is King Ghidor Ghidorah? I don't know. I'm just gonna call him King. Um, <laughs> cause I can't, I don't want to try and suss that one out. I am amazed you submitted so many, Wyndham. Thank you for uh, your contribution to this. No, <laughs> I can't do that without actually knowing any of these, I want to say. Um, yeah. <laughs> so it, it does look very small. There wasn't like a good image of it where it also looked big and imposing compared to the other ones. Oh god, I don't have monster fucker brain. How do I... <laughs> I have to make choices though, because I'm not a coward, so... Alright. Uh, I'll put you here. Um, we could watch Godzilla movies. I have literally never seen Godzilla or King Kong or any of that. Like, I, I just don't think about it. Like, I heard the new Godzilla movie or something is really good. Mm. Let's see. Okay. Because this is sent in, let me think about it seriously. <clears throat> so, we're gonna go with Mary Godzilla because I know Godzilla has a stable career um, in movies. <laughs> they are all reptiles. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, let's go with Mary Godzilla. Um,. I don't know, man. Oh, does Godzilla have a child? The more you know. Not ready to be a parent, but that's good to know. <laughs> yeah, famous movie star, Godzilla. Uh, mm. <laughs> Let's see. Mera is like this big turtley dude, and then King Ghidorah is uh like this three-headed wyvern creature. Step Monster Mommy sounds like it would be some like cringe Halloween film. Just saying. visual novel. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if it would be a reality show. I guess it could be, but I wouldn't- I can't think of how to frame that. I guess though when I think of reality shows, I think of Flavor Flav, because <laughs> it's the only reality show I watch. I don't want to marry Godzilla. I don't want anything to do with this entire category. Alright, I'm gonna go with this, I think. I think. I don't know enough about kaiju, but... <laughs> I appreciate that the Whoever sent in this next one included an image or link for the last one. Thinking of like kitchen nightmare type shows. So this next one 
also has a repeat character from earlier. But I'm gonna grab a different image. <laughs> Unless it is preferred that I do not grab a different image and use one that I have already used. Kitchen nightmare type shows. Oh, okay. Yeah, when I think of reality television, I literally only ever think of Flavor Flav because it's the only one that I watch. <laughs> and me and a bunch of friends have the same, uh... Didn't realize the other person had, like, actually, um, watched it, and it was a bonding moment to realize we have both, uh, seen it. So the first character in this next group is Gil, again. I'm using Cast Gil. I'm using Caskill because I want to use Caskill. Um, <laughs> and uh, nobody told me I can't otherwise. So. <laughs> I'm using this image of him though because he looks stupid and so cute. Um, <laughs> All right, I have to go find pictures for the next one. On the contrary, foolish to think you would only have one image for real. Honestly, yeah, I have so many Gilgamesh pictures official and otherwise, so, um... I could probably just do one based off of all of the images in my folder, but we're not going to do that. Oh, why is this image so huge? <laughs> Let me get a slightly smaller one so I can actually resize it properly. Um, this might be better, I think. Oops. No, that should be okay. Uh, the next character in this, uh, is also Gilgamesh, but from Final Fantasy. <laughs> Some creative thinking going on. Yeah, Greg. And then the last one I was kindly given an image to use. And um, it's Gilgamesh from the Epic of Gilgamesh, the actual mythology story. <laughs> I'm sorry, this one's actually also easy for me, so, um, we're going to be moving along shortly. How do I even, like, label this? Caskill, Gil FF, and then Gil Real? Question mark. NYC is pretty good though. I love Gilfest and Grand Order because it always runs like right over my birthday. <laughs> I was like, wow, Ascension Mats for me? <laughs> You're right, I could label Mythology Last Gil as Gilgamesh. I'm gonna do that. <laughs> Alright, I have an answer for you very quick answer for you. <laughs> Wait, no. Mm, no, yeah. This one. I have to double check and my brain is like, yeah, Gilgamesh goes in this category and it's like, which Gilgamesh? There we go. Yeah, I would kill Greg, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, we didn't do this one yet.
Why would you do this to me? <laughs> There's so many like same groupings of characters. Um, and you will understand what group this is. Your surprise? This was your submission? <laughs> I was wondering who sent that one in. <laughs> oh god, you'd have to specify which... which ones. Uh, hold on, I need to get a good picture of this one. You could feasibly do that with Da Vinci, Da Vinci, and Da Vinci. <laughs> okay. So, the first one in this group is the ninth Doctor from Doctor Who. Um, whoever sent this in, I think you're mean. <laughs> yeah! I would smash the stone tablet guy. What about it? <laughs> I don't want to fuck fake Gilgamesh. Or not fake Gilgamesh. Final Fantasy Gilgamesh. We are about to discuss 9, 10, 11. That is exactly what is about to happen. I'm just trying to find a nice image for 10 that I want to use. Let's use this one. This one's cute. <laughs> Alright. Oh god, I have to resize it. Uh, okay. This one's cute. There we go. Speaking of, the Doctor Who specials are out. The first one was really good, no spoilers. Oh god, don't do Matt Smith's doctor dirty like this. He didn't deserve that season. You cannot submit Anis here because he was a real person. I said no real people. I don't want to get in trouble for anything, so, and I feel like it's in bad taste to judge real people for this kind of thing. Alright. 9, 10, 11. Um. Oh, wait. I just labeled this group Doctor Who instead of, like, following my label system. <laughs> Whoops. So this one is 11, 10, and then 9. Oh god. Hi Shadow. It's okay to lurk. Um, yeah, this does suck to choose. <laughs> I actually like all of them. <laughs> So, I'm like, uh, hmm. <laughs> Ninth Doctor was really cool. I really, really wish he had gotten, like, more seasons than what he got. But, um, you know, it is what it is. And, uh, yeah. Fuck 9, marry 10, kill 11. I do also think that is what I'm going to do. Um, <laughs> about the old guy. Are you talking about, uh, I don't know who you're talking about. <laughs> Was 12 old? Oh, um, I mean, he's not on here, so I don't have to say shit. 
Yeah, I think I would definitely go fuck 9, marry 10, and then kill 11. I, I like Matt Smith's doctor, I want to say. I think he did a good job, but the doctor during his seasons wasn't, like, my favorite, um, and I fell off watching. I fell off watching uh, once it got to Clara in his group of seasons. Yeah. Intense Doctor is really good though. I miss his seasons. <laughs> so I'm gonna let this one slide because this is VTubers. Oh yeah, no, I I would not marry Nine. Um, Nine is not in an emotional place to be married to. Arguably, neither is any state of the Doctor, but I think Ten is maybe the most stable out of the three options here. <laughs> okay, um, so this next group... I did say no real people, but since this one is VTubers, I will let it slide because this is like 2.5D and it, it, it's okay, I think. You could have submitted VTubers. If it was a no-go, I would just say so. Um, this one's a little bit. This one is a little bit mean to me specifically. <clears throat> so the first one is. Oops. Why do I keep doing that? <laughs> okay. The first one is Suzuhara Lulu. Oh, I miss her. I mean, she reincarnated. You didn't hear that from me. But yeah, Lulu. I love her. She, she's so good. I miss her. <laughs> yeah, VTubers are kind of in a weird spot. Um, like, if you had submitted, like, 3D idol people to me, I would be like, no. Get out of my house. Um, I'll just open up a folder for this one, actually, because they have pictures. <laughs> uh, let's use this one. The next one is Hayato Kagami, who is my Kami Oshi and Niji Sanji. Whoever submitted this, um, why? <laughs> oh god, how do I keep resizing this? Oh my god. Okay, here we go. I am using his casual outfit and not his default because, um, I like his glasses. <laughs> and that's really all there is to that. <laughs> and the third one... You can take a guess who the third one is. Third one, let me close this. It is. It is, in fact, Voxakuma. My favorite British gremlin man. Yeah. Maybe I should have grabbed his, like, current outfit. Oh well, it's fine. I'm not glad you got me into VTubers have ruined my life. <laughs> this is a joke. Oh, Kagami had a concert recently for his birthday. It was really good. Okay. Um, let me label these real quick. So Vox, Kagami, and uh, Lulu. Alright. Um, 
I thought about it. I'm just going to go with my knee-jerk answer for this. Name a baseball player, Fox Yashiro. I miss Fox Yashiro. That was so funny. That was like the funniest um, Koshian that I've watched, I think, out of the three that I have seen. I would never harm it, Kami Oshi. Sorry, Vox. Sorry, Vox. There's a lot of British violence in my kill category, I'm realizing. <laughs> I will say, I don't think I could kill Lulu also, but... <laughs> That's not why she's not in the murder category. I just really like Lulu. Um... Sorry, Vox. <laughs> I don't... Well, no, that's... Mm, I'm going to... Uh... <laughs> Not say anything. <laughs> Hard choice between decking Vox and vibe checking Vox. I think Vox could use a vibe check periodically. I don't think he deserves to get decked. Or killed, frankly, but a, a vibe check every now and then might be good for him. <laughs> oh, God, it jaw hurts. Okay. Um, let me grab another image for this one. This one also has duplicate characters. All of the characters in this next, next set have already been asked about in different groups before. I will say. Uh... Surely I have a nice picture of you somewhere. Or is that on my other hard drive? <laughs> I think a lot of people could use a solid vibe check every now and then, TBH. So considering this was specified, which version uh, of the characters, I will try and pull up images from that. I might not have screen caps though. They all catered to you. Yeah, this was- I did ask people who know me specifically really to submit to this. <laughs> So, it tracks, I think. Um, oh, did I not screen have screenshots of them on hand? Okay, I will Google that. Not for this one, but. All of the characters in this next group are from Fate, by the way. <laughs> I was trying to look for a different image that was, like, nice, but... No, I don't mean that. I mean what I typed. So, the first person in this group is... Saber from Stay Night. Instead of sending you like Mario, Luigi, Bowser type stuff. You know, <laughs> I was kind of expecting more of that actually because uh, I also know all of my friends are gremlin people. So. <laughs> um, let's see. And then the next character in this is going to be Emiya again, but I will, since he is in here for the third time, I will give him a different image. <laughs> I did get the kaiju. The kaiju question was wild. 
Oh, did this corrupt a little bit? It did. Oh well. It's fine. I'll we'll use this picture of him. This isn't the most flattering picture of him, but he already has one good one. <laughs> I love this image of him. This is like in one of my folders and I just see it periodically and laugh. Um, okay. And... The last character in this group is Gilgamesh from Stay Night specifically. So, let me look for a picture of him from Stay Night, specifically. Yeah, no, he's fucking dying, dude. Like, I, I love Gil. I do not love Stay Night Gil. I like Gil in any, literally anything else that he's in, except Stay Night. Okay. Here we go. This one is... Victoria. No, he has a personality in Zero. Yeah, Emiya is gonna sweep, I think, because between these options, the only person I'm gonna marry, I think, is Artori. <laughs> you should watch other fate mood, yeah. Yeah, he's literally sleeping. It's, I'm still on her layer. Ah! Alright. I, like... Would Arturia be a, a good, like, wife, husband? You know, I think in Stay Night, probably because she is capable of self-reflection and doing better. Um, Archer's got problems. I don't want to deal with those problems. I just want to smash and go. <laughs> <laughs> and um Stay Night Gil can die. I'm sorry, he's a plot device, he has no personality, he just kind of is there. And he sucks. Um <laughs> my strongest opinion that Stay Night Gilgamesh is the worst Gilgamesh. And I'm right! <laughs> As much. That's true. Gil isn't in all of them. Um, Gil is really good in extra CCC, which isn't out in the US, unfortunately. Extella and Extella Link are out in the US, though. Um, he's also really good in Strange Fake. <clears throat> And then Carnival Phantasm. He's very cute in Carnival Phantasm. Uh, oh, I might actually have pictures for this one on hand too. Let me... Okay, so we are on group 19 now. Oh my god. Okay. We watch Apocrypha and UBW and Zero. Yeah, that's fair, I think. Um, the Adam's Field movies are worth a watch, I think, also. <clears throat> yeah. He is better in uh, things that aren't the original. Alright, 
So the first person in this is Minato. We're just gonna copy paste him from this art because this is what I have the highest quality on my PC right now. The love of my life. Um... I know, right? I'm shocked that he took so long to show up in this. Probably because this is an easy win character, because I keep referring him to spe er, specifically as the love of my life. Um. <laughs> but it's true, I do love him. <laughs> um, let's see. And then the next character in this... Do I have a picture for you saved on this PC, actually? Might not. Um, I thought I did, though. Is this decent quality? Yeah, decent enough. Okay. Second character on this is P4 Kun. The Chad of the Persona series. One day I will play P4 on stream, so I can make people understand this point about him. Um, <laughs> but he is not my wife or anything else, so I have to make this bigger. I thought that image was larger than it is. Yeah, Chad and Aru call me. Um, I like how I managed to get an image of him that's not even his game, like, color. Because the color for P4 is, uh, yellow. <laughs> and I grabbed one in the blue background. Um, amazing how I managed to do that. Uh, t -t -t -t. Where is- there's a specific image of P5kun, who is the last character on this that I want to use, that I know is in this folder. Um, go with this one. This one's a little bit small, so I'll just copy-paste it. <clears throat> and P5kun, which is a game I need to get back to on stream, uh, for Royal, at least. Uh, let me, let me blur Ryuji a little bit. How does it do that? Uh, now nah, it's doing it badly. We'll go with that one. It's fine. You'll be able to see him anyway. I tried. Hi, Ichi. <laughs> Love that none of these have any of their game colors in it except for Minato. Put like a tiny black bar on him. JK. Protecting his identity. Um, oh wait, hold on, let me adjust this back. Yeah, I think that's fine. For now. Okay. So this one is. <laughs> you just. You're also a Kendrick! <laughs> Say that! <laughs> You're right though, but please. <laughs> no, you're right. You're right. I think even if you had put him up against other Loxia members, I would also still... <laughs> anyway... <laughs> Um, anyway, so, like, this is the easiest Mary pick in this entire thing, actually, because this goes without saying. Um, <laughs> between, between you and Ren, though, I, I'm not sure. Um, you's not really my type, going off of, like, visuals, but he- he is 
Mr. Chad Swagson of the Persona series for real. Hmm. <laughs> This stream is definitely just a learning things about me stream more than anything else, I feel. <laughs> uh, oh god. I would say that, um, Ren is probably more my type than you is. Which makes this hard, because I also know both of these characters. <laughs> I don't think I want to kill Ren though because he's gone through enough. He's gone through enough, I think. Which means I unfortunately have to kill you. But not you as in the viewer, but you as in the character. <laughs> I'm so sorry, I don't actually feel good about putting him in that care category. <laughs> Yeah, sorry, Chad. Oh my god. <laughs> I actually feel really, really bad putting him in that category because he doesn't deserve that. Um, oh, this is a group of characters that I don't have images for because... Uh... <laughs> Alright. Every character on this list is from... Grand Blue Fantasy. Oh wait, I can be normal again. I keep forgetting to switch my sprite. <laughs> well, he's a protag, so it'll probably be like, yeah, kill me instead of the other guy, and then be fine through the power of friendship. This is true! He will definitely be fine through the power of friendship. He 100% will be okay through the power of friendship. Because <laughs> this is a JRPG and that's just how it goes. I think I put the wrong glove on the wall. Um, this one has a close-up in the uncap, so I'm going to use this one. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, exactly. I think P4 is like the most power of friendship of the three games, honestly. So if anybody's going to survive solely based off of that, it would be him. So... The first character in this is, um... Tyre from Grand Blue. Which is a fascinating pick. I actually like him as a character, but he's not somebody I think about very often. Tire, yeah. <laughs> and then the second character, do I have a picture of you? Because I also don't think about you. <laughs> so sorry. I need to get a better picture of them. Uh, you know, that's not entirely wrong i guess as far as like the general vibe of his look but he is not <laughs> okay uh i have to find a better picture because um the unit art for this character is not great <laughs> for this <laughs> um Yeah, just a little bit. Oh, this was also on this wiki page. Damn. Is this your submission, Zero? Because this is a group of characters. Isaac? So we have Tyre and Isaac, who are two slightly genre different genres of characters. Yeah, I, I thought about using his um hold on, let me just copy it and paste it. Cause the other image that I could have used for him is this. Uh 
which I thought about just putting down, but not everybody here plays Grand Blue Fantasy, so I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> All right, let's let's just get his fucking shock suit out of here. And the last one on here um, is also a pick because this is definitely somebody I don't think about. <laughs> Is there I can't believe you. <laughs> Let me at least get their newer art. <laughs> and not like their R, which is what I was immediately pointed to. <laughs> um, who's this one? I wanna know what went through your head when you picked these characters, actually. Oh wait, uh, this isn't my icon file. Oh. And the last one is, um, Richard. All of them Grandly characters. A very fascinating, uh, set of characters to pick. Yeah, I, I thought about it very briefly, and um, I, I am going to kill Richard. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's just the truth of it. Uh, between Isaac and Tyre, though, here's the thing. Neither of these characters are bad people. Um, there's not characters I think too much about. Um... But I do like Tyre. I do think Tyre is a good boy, and he certainly does his earnest best. Uh, he would probably be a good husband. <laughs> I think. A little bit clumsy, but Tyre does have a job. He is a knight. This is a man with stability in his life. Um, yeah, I guess I would fuck Isaac. Why not? If I was smashed, perhaps. Um, <laughs> sorry, that's so mean. Um, but yeah, if I was smashed, perhaps. Um, <laughs> technically, I guess. But Tyre has like a job he can go back to after being on the Grand Cipher. I feel like I know who submitted this, but... I'm not gonna, I'm gonna say who all of these characters are until I'm making the icons. <clears throat> yeah. I I think Tyre is probably the safest choice for Mary. Um I don't care about Richard. I'm I'm sorry. <laughs> Um, there has to be a better image of this man than, like, what is popping up. Okay, uh, okay. This one? No, he does not deserve a fuck. Okay, so the first character in this one is Kota Kazuraba from Kamen Rider Gaim. This is the first common writer that I have uh, ever watched, for the record. And I have a couple of guesses as to who submitted this. I'm not gonna out them, but like. Kota. Kota is a good boy, though. All of- generally the protagonists for common writers are really good boys. This one's weird. This one's a little bit mean. Um, da -da -da -da. Yeah, then there's Tendo, but Tendo is also me. That's just a male version of me, Tendo Soji.
Oh, come on. There has to be a better picture of you than this. This one? Open. Thank you. <clears throat> and then the second one is Gentaro Genchan, who is my son. And putting him on this is evil, by the way. Um, <laughs> evil. <laughs> oh god, okay. This would be so much easier if these are all common Rider characters from the same series, but the thing is they're all protagonists from different <laughs> <laughs> I don't like this. <laughs> okay. Um, and the last one. The last one is Heart of Soma from Kamen Rider Wizard. This is also evil. But it's not as evil as putting Genchon on this. Putting Gintaro on this is, um, cruel and unusual. Being sent by Gens here. Yeah, putting Haruto on here is mean. Um, so I'm not going to fuck Genshin, that's just how it is. I'm also not going to kill him though, so he's gonna go solidly into this category. Um... Because I, I, I can't, I, <laughs> I have to protect him, <laughs> like, I know. <laughs> Gen just wants to be everybody's friend. He is also the personification of the power of friendship, and I cannot bring harm to him. That's just- that's just such a truth. <laughs> Honestly, he deserves his own category, but I'm not a coward, so we're just going to leave it like this. This is the closest we can get. If you think about it, being married to somebody is like the ultimate friend situation. <laughs> oh god, I was justifying that so hard that I was like, oh god, my throat dried out. <laughs> Yeah, the benefit is he gets to tell me how good my food is. <laughs> um, oh god, I... Here's the thing, right? Between these two, I actually like Haruto's style more visually. Like, if they stood next to each other, I, I would probably pick Haruto. But I know both of these guys. Um, <laughs> they are friends to me. <laughs> um, <laughs> I hate that this is really hard to pick. Um, but I also know Koda, and I think Koda is a good boy, and I I like him a lot. Um, but Koda does his own stunts. Um, and I love abs. So, <laughs> I'm so sorry. I don't, I don't want to kill her. I hate putting him down here. This sucks. <laughs> this sucks. I'm so sorry, Haruto. <laughs> Evil. <laughs> Evil question. Jesus Christ. Um, I think killing Haruto feels a little bit worse because he's at least, like, live action 3D. I was wondering if this was you because this, this feels like something that she would have maybe submitted just because it's a common writer thing. And I... I have a singular guess now who it is, if it isn't you. 
And they're probably not here. <laughs> oh god. Oh, that is my island stonks alarm, which, um, I guess I will check my island on 14 after this stream. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't think they're here. Um, okay, let me make the folder for the next group. Um, this is such an enlightening stream. <laughs> it's also very interesting for me at least to like see what people uh think to submit to me so uh do i want to use this image yes i'll use this one <clears throat> i have a feeling which kr i know which common writer dudes you would send but uh yeah so the first person in this group is Horshefront from Final Fantasy XIV. I don't know who sent this one. I have a guess. I also have a guess who sent this one. <clears throat> yeah, you would think it would have been sooner, right? But it also took um, a fuck ton of submissions to get to Minato. So, it is what it is. So the first person in this group, um, is Horshfond. And the second person in this group has also shown up before. Oops. That's not what I was clicking. I would be surprised, um, if somebody didn't know I like Horsha Fund at this point. I don't talk about Minato as much because, um, I haven't had reason to, but the second person in this group is Jing Yuan. I don't talk about Minato as much. I'm not going to change my sprite because I think this still applies for this group. <laughs> um... Yeah, I- the thing is, people who have known me for a really long time know how I am about Minato. It just hasn't come out recently because I'm content starved. Um, and the last person in this is Zhang Li from Genshin Impact. Um, whoever sent me this, why do you hate me? <laughs> what did I do to you? <laughs> um... I'm also, uh, <laughs> yeah, I, I don't get much content for P3 Minato, but Reload is coming out next year, which means I will have content again. That'd be great. Um, anyway, I'm gonna marry Horshabon. <laughs> Sorry, this is the truth of the matter. Um, we're gonna just pretend that things that happen in 14 don't occur for the sake of this. But, um, yeah, he has a stable career. He also deserves a lot of love and affection, and uh, that's all I'm going to say on that. We did kind of pass that. There are a lot of these where I, so far, where I've been like, oh yeah, I can make a snap decision. That's, that's fine. Getting into the ones where I'm like, oh, oh no, let me think. Um, uh, between Jing Yuan and Zhang Li, though, I'm gonna think, because I would fuck both of them. This is a problem here. Oh my god, I'll do that. <laughs> I mean, you can. Uh, next time I just make a tier, like, tournament brackets and you guys just watch me agonize over it for, like, two hours again. 
Jesus Christ. Um, uh, I'm gonna go with fuck Zhang Li and kill Jun Yuan, which sucks, but like I said, I'm not a coward. We make decisions in this house. We just don't always like them. <laughs> anyway, moving on. <laughs> I'm also gonna be posting this on Twitter later, but like, Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's a way to put it, Zero. <laughs> that is a way to put it. If I think about it this way, um, Zhang Li's ultimate is literally smashing things into each other. Anyway, um, <laughs> this next group, I'm actually surprised that this character also took a while to get to because, um, I feel like I mentioned them quite a bit lately. Um, let me find a better picture of them than this. Yeah, let's use this one. We will use this one because I think this one perfectly, uh, suits them. <laughs> Konami Date is the first character on this. Um, if you're unfamiliar, he is the protagonist of I, the Somnium Files and a supporting character in the Nirvana Initiative, which is the sequel. <clears throat> yeah, I also thought he would show up sooner. <laughs> um, but yeah, Konami Date. And the next character I also need to grab an image for. No, that's fine. I understand. I'm just shocked it took so long for him to pop up. Um... <laughs> yeah, Hat, when are you going to watch my I Need streams? Um... Let's go with this one. <laughs> okay. And yeah, I'll just leave Ryuki's name in there. Second person on this is Ryuki, who is one of the protagonists of the second game. Um, play Ida Somnium Files. If you love me, you will play Ida Somnium Files and then play Ida Somnium Files Nirvana Initiative. Yeah. I don't have another picture of him. The other picture I have of him is a spoiler. I'm curious who actually sent this one in. Yeah, this is not a spoiler, so... This shows up like two seconds into the second game, so... Not a spoiler. Okay. Um, and the last character on this, I, I have a guess who sent this, to be honest, but... Wait, why isn't it... Oh, because it's fucking huge, that's why I can't see the corners. <laughs> this last character in this is, um, Aiba. Who I love. <laughs> And is also a fascinating choice put in between uh, these characters, to be honest. Should I? Let me 
you mean tilt it? Like that? this one back down. Okay. <clears throat> Space Cat is also one of my portraits on 14 and I always laugh whenever I see it because I always forget that it's there <laughs> when I'm doing things. Okay. Yeah, no problem. Not a hard fix to do. <clears throat> um... I'm going to kill Date. No, I'm kidding. I'm not going to do that. I think. <laughs> Let me think about it. Um, I actually like all of these characters. <laughs> so. Um, I'm not going to marry Aiba, I think. Because Aiba is an eyeball. No, you're right. Let me think about this, though. Here's the thing. Ryuki is, um, as you can tell, this is not a spoiler. He's not, he's not okay. This is also not a spoiler, but he has money. Um, Dante is not a bad guy, but... He is a fucking idiot. <laughs> Listen, my financial stability is very important to me. <laughs> I gotta think about it. <laughs> um, hmm. But Iba is an eyeball. Like, let's let's just start there. Iba is in fact an eyeball. Uh, I don't want illegally acquired money, Ross. <laughs> I just want financial stability. <laughs> oh god. Okay, here's what we're going to do. And this is going to be met with protest, but this is my chart, so, um... Y'all are just gonna have to live with learning things about me today, I guess. It's fine, we can bring Aiba back. Surely. Somehow. Yeah, she has backups. Is this one a shock? What were you expecting me to pick? I want to know, what were you expecting me to say? <laughs> That's fair. I also looked at this and was like, would I kill Aiba? But we're making hard choices here today. Yeah, she's got backups. <laughs> yeah. I'm not gonna fucking eyeball. Sorry. If Iba was like... I'm going to say right now, it is not a surprise that I would put Date in the fuck category, because I've been after him since before the game even came out. <laughs> I saw this man and I was like, I want him. This did not change after playing the game. Listen, it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. 
he does kind of deserve it a little bit, I think. But, um, yeah, sorry. Iba, Iba is an eyeball. If Iba was, like, had a physical human form that was not just the eyeball hamster, I would probably have married her and, um, killed Date and then fucked Ryuki. I don't think that would fix Ryuki, though. Ryuki also is in the category of, if this was therapy, Murray kill, he would go into therapy. So, um... <laughs> I, I can't do anything except that. So this is how it goes. Um... So this next category is... No, you have to understand, Ross, there's an order to this. The order is fuck, marry, kill. So I would fuck Ryuki, and then I would get with Aiba and marry Aiba, and then I would kill Date. If it was that scenario. Listen... <laughs> I don't think about the order in which I say words sometimes. I have the opportunity to do the funniest thing, but I'm probably not going to do that. Um, <laughs> Alright, we're gonna move on to the next group. I should have known. I, I knew this pit, that group was going to be controversial once I uh, decided where everybody's going. <laughs> so, um, the first person in this group is Galleon from uh, Grand Blue Fantasy. Looking at the rest of the characters, I assume they mean her playable, so uh, we're using her playable. <clears throat> yeah, they're gigantic. She also has large ears. I love blessings. Um, let's see. Will this resize okay? I think this will be fine. <clears throat> the second character is... Narmaya. Who also has some big horns. And the last character on this, I think, um, will be a surprise, considering the theming so far. Because <laughs> I also am <laughs> surprised scrolling down and seeing this after seeing those two. <laughs> um, it's Medion from Grimly Fantasy, who I love and adore, and I'm still mad that his first SSR was a Christmas unit um, that I had to anti-tix, but it's fine. <laughs> yeah, media. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying first because I'm coping that he'll get a proper permanent SSR. Let me be. <laughs> the same way I'm coping that I'll get Grand Lucifer one day. How dare you? <clears throat> oh god, I'm talking so much that I'm getting stuffy. Uh. Okay. Um. Sorry, if you see me turning them on and off, it's because I'm trying to make sure I'm labeling this correctly. Oh my god. Um... Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> this is really difficult, um, because, okay, I'm gonna say one thing. Grand Blue has an extremely large cast that it's really hard to not have multiple favorites. If you all like 
uh, that you like pretty equally, all things considered. Um, and I would say that I like all of these characters pretty equally. Um, where my brain is at, at any given time is based off of uh, vibes, <laughs> mostly. <laughs> so, um, let me think. God, this date art of Beyond is so good, though. <laughs> um, hmm. Well, I gotta marry Narmaya, right? Like, that's just facts. Out of everybody in this group, I've liked her the longest. <laughs> he does have the holiday unit buff. Um. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't have a better picture of Galleon at a quick search. Because if I tried to find a better one, I think we'd be here all day. Because there's not much out for her yet. And I don't actually like her anniversary outfit that much. I think if I wanted near Automata vibes, I would play near Automata. <laughs> oh god. Um, I don't want to kill either of them. I do think that the person who has the highest survivability rate between the two, if I tried to kill them, would be Galleon. Um, but also Galleon would wish blessings upon me just generally outside of the context of potential murder. Um, I don't want to kill Mion because he's a good boy. <laughs> I met him and I fell in love instantly. <laughs> Which is the same thing for Galleon. <laughs> um... But like I said all stream, I'm not a coward and have to make decisions. But this is a hard decision. Unlike the last one, which was just controversial. This is true. This is true. I do have to kill her daily to do to get materials. So I guess in that respect, I have already done that. You're right. You're so right. Oh god. I'm on the wrong layer again. You are so right. This is controversial also. I'll have it on record. I would not kill her if this is a choice. You see, the nice version of this game is, uh, fuck, Mary kiss. Um, I don't want to play that. So, um, we'll, we'll go with this. Because it is true. Galleon is a daily. Oh god. Put this in. <laughs> should ban you all from submitting fake characters. <laughs> um, I don't have images for all of these except for one of them. So... <laughs> Let me... Okay. So... Come on. Up. Oh. There we go. Oh. <clears throat> so the first character in this group is Artoria. And let me grab the next one. This might actually not be too bad to pick. It's just wild that this is something someone thought to submit to me as far as characters go. <laughs> I feel like because I don't really talk about Artoria. Um, the second character is Artoria Lancer. This was specified. <clears throat> And the last one is... Oh, actually, I think I have a better piece of art in my folder that I would like to use for this because it's pretty. Oh god, where is my fate folder? It is time. Oh 
Okay. Oh yeah, this one works because this is promotional material. <clears throat> and Arturia Alter, who I am using this art for because I just think this one is pretty. Oh god, I forgot the skin for this is gigantic. Yeah, he was still up into tab. <clears throat> and the last one is um, Arturia Alter. So I do have an answer for this. I have a pretty immediate answer to this. Um, <laughs> let me just finish labeling just in case I need to grab these again for some reason. Okay. Um, <clears throat> so between Arturia, OG Arturia, Arturia Lancer, and Arturia Alter. For me, it's definitely gotta be uh, like this. I'm so sorry. I don't actually like alters all that much. Jan Alter is an exception. I don't. I, I think altars are not that great of a concept. <laughs> oh god, what is this? This one has links for me at least. Um, <laughs> yeah. And uh, Arterial Answer also has a big titty going for her. Thank you for listening. <laughs> Okay, I'm not fam really familiar with this because I don't uh, play Yu-Gi-Oh anymore, and all of this is from Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> oh, this is such a character design. A good character design, though. Okay. So the first one is uh, Long Long Ear Long Earsu, the Orchest Orchestrator. I'm gonna have to label this so I don't lose track because I'm not familiar with these cards. It's very funny to me that uh, Yu-Gi-Oh cards made it into this. By the way. <laughs> Is this one a pretty girl? Please tell me this is a pretty girl. <laughs> a name like that, it has to be, right? Yeah! Let's go! Okay, hold on. <laughs> Alright, and then the next one, does she fit? She does fit. Okay is Lovely Labyrinth of the Silver Castle. I don't play Yu-Gi-Oh anymore when them. Probably, though. If this is recognizable. <coughs> I used to play... Uh... <laughs> I'm sorry you can't appreciate Kaya's nice tits. Uh, Ross, but they are nice tits. And then the last one is what does this say? Eldalic, the Golden Lord. There we go. So, um, I assume this is all vibe space because they've never really given personalities to monsters, which is fine. Eldalic, yeah. <clears throat> I 
Oh, okay. The more you know. <clears throat> um. Yeah, okay. I, because this is vibes based, this is also gonna be fast. Sorry, I see a pretty girl and, um. <laughs> I didn't mean to move that entire group. There you go. <laughs> Despite the fact I like Gilgamesh, I'm not that into flashy gold characters. <laughs> He's an exception. I don't know who submitted this. <laughs> this next one. Oh, that's fine then. I can guilt-free put him in that category. Okay. We are on group 27, which means after this one, we only have five more to do? This one is funny though, because I've actually- this group is funny because I have been thinking about this series, uh, recently. Um, let's use this image. I haven't actually played this one yet, but it's okay. <laughs> it's fine. So the first person in this group is Miles Edgeworth from Ace Attorney. I love him. He's so good. Yeah! A great character. Um, come on, a little smaller. I'm trying to get his entire head in. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I used a huge render of him for this. <laughs> okay, so first character is Edgeworth. And then, oh god, thanks. Thank you for whoever sent this one for including an image <laughs> so i didn't have to search <clears throat> okay. and then the second one is barack van zeeks from uh the great ace attorney i think i think he's from tga haven't played this one yet i have I think I saved an image of him doing his objections, though. <clears throat> this is true, but I haven't played The Great Ace Attorney, so I have a feeling they included it just to spare me uh, spoilers. <clears throat> and this last one is um, Gundam Tanaka from SDR2. No, that is a joke. That is not who this is. Um, it's Simon Black Quill. But I do look at him and think of Gundam from uh, Danganronpa 2. <laughs> okay, so out of all of these characters, I'm actually only familiar with uh, Miles. Um, I, I play through a lot of games very slowly, completely. Because I just have a lot of things to do. <clears throat> um, yeah, so out of these characters, I think I'm gonna marry Miles. Um, we're going to get a divorce shortly afterwards because he's actually married to Phoenix, right? This is a sham wedding, it's for a photo shoot. Um, <laughs> oh god, but now I have to think about the other two. Um, hmm. These are two very different brands of the Edge. Uh, there's something very important to know about me, and it's that I don't like to share. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to just resize this so it's all on the screen. There we go. I do not like to share. Um, <laughs> yeah, 
And I think Miles would be happier with Phoenix. Uh. Hmm. Hmm. So this is strictly based off of vibes. I don't know anything about these characters. Um. Let's go with this. If I meet them, this will inevitably change. I will, I will eventually meet them because I have all of the games. I just... <laughs> oh god. Okay. Um, yeah, I was, I'm surprised this one hadn't shown up yet. Okay. Let me just actually grab previous ones. Okay, so this one is, um, Gilgamesh, Gilgamesh, and Gilgamesh again? <laughs> oh boy, okay. But they have specified these Gilgameshes as well, and the first one on this is Archer Gil. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Is that group 15? Okay. Um, Caskill. And I'm just going to copy these because I could do a bunch of different ones, but this stream has been going on for a while. So. And then Ruler Gill, who I will have to grab a picture of. So give me one second. Ruler Yell is in Samurai Remnant. He is so cute. I'm going to strangle him. Um, <laughs> uh, vocal. I took so many pictures when he first showed up. Uh, <laughs> okay, so. Yeah. Ruler Gill. God bless whoever did the character design for Samurai Remnant for putting him in with his hair down. This is for me. <laughs> I just I'm I still need to make progress in Samurai Remnant. Um, he does look really good in Samurai Remnant. So, and you can visit him whenever you want. <laughs> as long as you're not story locked from going to the shop, you can go see him whenever you want to. <laughs> oh, I'm in Samurai Remnant though, he's so funny. Um,. You can carve a statue of him. I'm really bad at it. <laughs> I haven't done it successfully. <clears throat> uh, oh god. Okay. Um, yeah, I have an answer for this. Uh, I'm gonna marry Caskill again. Sorry, just facts. I'm going to kill Archer Gill, which feels bad to say, but, um... Also facts, and I will fuck his Samurai Remnant version because he is so good in Samurai Remnant. <laughs> uh, his entire like cutscene when you meet him in Samurai Remnant, it took me like an absurd amount of time to get through, and after I finished it, I just immediately like laid down and passed out for like four hours because I was so tired from doing it and I was like this wasn't even a long scene. <laughs> I'm so tired. Okay, um, this is uh, this is this. Okay, so moving on to group 29. I'm so glad that this chart is very full though. I did not think I had enough characters to do this when I 
was like, yeah, let's let's play this game. Old lady voice coming out. Okay. So the first character on this um, is Konami Date. Everyone's controversial pick for me letting live. Uh, <laughs> Okay, and then the second character I don't have an icon for, but I do have a second chance. I'm ready. Let's kill him. Uh, <laughs> and then the second character on this. Is my man Joshua Fire Emblem. And I will never forgive the dub actors or whoever decided on the dub voices for making him voiced by Todd Habercorn. How could you do this to me? I wish he was voiced by somebody else. No offense to Todd Habercorn, but he's just not my favorite. And then the last character. Oh, wait, I have a picture of this character I can use. <laughs> yeah, let me pull it up. <laughs> oh, sorry, I saw something else in this folder that I'm just like cracking up at. <sighs> okay. <clears throat> The last character on this list is, um, Ku. Aniki. Fun fact, before Gil was my favorite character in Fate, my favorite characters in Stay Night were Issei and Ku, um, which I believe tracks with my biases. <laughs> oh no, I'm killing Date. <laughs> yeah, like, I, I don't control the die for Ku, or I don't want that control. Um... <laughs> the fucking, yeah, woo. I, yeah, I'm just sorry, Date. It's gotta be like this. Um, gonna marry Joshua. And, uh, fuck Ku. I zoomed out a little bit too much, I think, but y'all can see. <laughs> yeah. Oh god, why are you doing that? Uh, nope. Sorry, I'm like watching this zoom in and out on the screen thing. Down. Okay. Uh, that'll, that'll do. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, Date. Um... Your turn to die. <laughs> After I finished reading that list, I was like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. This one's, um, surprising. And unexpected. I guess that goes as surprising, but just, like, I would not have guessed this would get submitted. <laughs> this is one of the last uh, submissions to be thrown in tonight, actually. Because um, there were 27 submissions, actually, when I checked. And I was like, oh, surely nobody's going to put more in. Um, but they did. And first up on this list is uh, Tobey Maguire Spider-Man, specified to be Tobey Maguire. <laughs> Yeah.
Yeah. Um. <laughs> Which is why I was like, this is interesting. <laughs> Is there a good image? It's a little bit... Oops, not what I meant to do. <laughs> what is this? Who sent this? I want to know who sent this. And the next one is, uh... Andrew Garfield Spider-Man. <laughs> You are correct that the last one is, in fact, Tom Holland's Spider-Man. <laughs> Andrew Garfield's Spidey was really good. That one did not get enough credit. All the Spider-Men pointing at each other. Get extra comments. Spider Man pointing meme in all caps. <laughs> I just looked down and was like, oh, there is an extra comment. Uh, okay. Gotta get the suit in there to specify that these are all Spider Men. I should have really gotten them all with their masks, so you just couldn't tell which Spider-Man it was. Oh well. <laughs> okay. So, this is... Group 30. We are almost done, guys. Jesus Christ. Um... I'm so sorry to Tom Holland, but I, I would kill his Spider-Man. Like he's baby, but he's got he he's got to die. <laughs> I don't have nostalgia for this. Is what I'm saying. Oh, that's so cute. Um. Hmm. This is just picking between Peter Parker's, which is such a thing to say. Uh, let's go, I think, with, I oh, like this Tobey Maguire's layer. Okay. Yeah, this is Peter's Parker. Okay. My chart is very full, so the last two are gonna be Last two groups are gonna have to be like really squished in. <clears throat> but we're gonna go with this. Sorry, Tom Holland, Peter Parker. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> okay. Oh my god. Uh, I forgot how to type for a second. I was just like, what, what does this say? <laughs> how do I type words? All oh, right, I forgot this needs a qualifier. <clears throat> so, first up. Is Jack Frost from the Shin Megami Tensei series? He is my friend. I have one of I have a plushie of Jack Frost sitting on my bookshelf. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Spider-Man pointing meme. Okay. Oh, why is this so huge? <laughs> okay. Um, the next one is... If I can zoom out enough to get the corners... Black Frost from the Shin Megami Tensei series. <laughs> this is so funny, actually. Um, yeah. SMT pointing meme. And then the last one is... Oh, it's this one? Okay, not the one I was expecting. I didn't specify which one of these, so I'm going to use this one. <laughs> I was wondering, um, but no, the last one is King Frost, also from the Shin Megami Tensei series. I was expecting Pyrojack, TBH. So let me label these. And this is Jack. Okay. Alright. Um. That's not. I my brain is like yeah. That's definitely gonna be. Um, what should we call it? Gonna be uh, fire jack, but it's not. Oh my god! I might have to make you a little smaller to fit you in here. Sorry, Coda. Okay. And Jack Frost. I had to pick Jack Frost because, uh, to bury because Jack Frost literally sits on my bookshelf. <laughs> I have one of these. Alright, uh, King Frost. I'll just put you there to kind of make it all the same. Okay, um, one more. Cat, did you submit this one? <laughs> Hat? <laughs> Was this you? <laughs> okay, I read the extra comment and I was like, this sounds like hat, but... For this next group... The first character in it um, is Shrek, who I need to get a better picture of because, wow, that came up tiny. I want you to know that I think I've only ever watched Shrek in part, so I don't think I have actually seen the movie in full all at once. Oh god. Okay. Yeah, because the only comment on this one, actually, is sorry. And I'm just like, all lowercase, sorry. And I'm like, mm. <laughs> Um, Shrek gave me a headache every time I tried to watch it. All lowercase, sorry? Yes, that sounds like you. Can you argue with that? Am I wrong? Uh, 
And the second character in this is uh, Fiona. Oh, whoa, well, why is it rotating? Sometimes it's spoiler marked, too. I hate that this is the last one that we're doing, but I suppose this is as fitting as any to end it on. <laughs> I'm shocked that p 3 Kun has only been in here once tonight. They did not specify any Fiona, so I'm picking human Fiona. And also, it's most of what comes up when I Google search her. Uh, uh. Is this? Okay, this is kind of small, but it should be fine. And the last one is Donkey. Um, I hate all of these options, actually, but... Again, not a coward. <laughs> I make choices. Um, so I'm not overly familiar with Shrek. So, um, yeah, they are all buried. In fact, the first two are married to each other, as far as I know. And I know Donkey is like with a dragon or something? Oh, true. This is a lot. I kind of hate this. But now that I know that Donkey has children, I do have to kill him. Because, um... I'll just, I guess, shove them off to the side here. <laughs> So I gotta fit people into rows. <laughs> um, okay, yeah. I can pick from there. And we'll go with that. Yeah. I hate that, though. I don't like any of these decisions. I would rather, I think, fuck Shrek once and then marry Fiona and, uh, fuck Fiona for the rest of my life if I had to pick. Yes. No, I don't want to live in a swamp. I want to live specifically in a cave with Wi-Fi. I have specified that all I have ever wanted to be is Matoya with Wi-Fi. There's actually like a Shrek house on Airbnb with Wi-Fi. I think. It, that's, this is also true. It's either a big an ogre or a donkey and I don't want to fuck a donkey either. At least Shrek, I guess, is humanoid. If you kill Donkey, you could take his wife who would probably live in a cave. Yes, that's true. But I don't want to steal his wife. I'm not like a monster fucker or a furry. If you want furry opinions, we're gonna have to, like, call my ex and ask his opinions. <laughs> He's even briefly human in one of the movies, no one specified. Yeah, there's no specification as to, like, what iteration of these characters. Um... Hold on. I was trying to find the Airbnb, but... I couldn't find the link to the page, so there's the article. But, uh, yeah. So that is all 32 submissions <laughs> for, uh, Fuck, Mary Kill. I think the most controversial one of the night was apparently my I the Somnium Files group pick. <laughs> 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 
Which I knew was going to be controversial, but the way everyone's like, You're not killing Date? <laughs> um, no. Not in that group. I must got backups. We'll be fine. <laughs> I am not doing a Mario Luigi Bowser bonus round though, because it is 9.30. I've been doing this for uh, three and a half hours now. Gilda did die three times. Um, the amount of gil on here is not actually shocking, I suppose. Um, a lot of these submissions were very surprising though. Like I... I was not expecting the kaijus. Uh, the very first submission surprised me. Yeah, the amount of Arturia is really surprising. Um, I don't talk about Arturia much, and she's not really one of my biases. I'm shocked that Nero didn't end up on here, like Fate Nero. Uh, I was expecting to see her in here, and she just was not, so... Yeah. I wasn't expecting the All Arturia one. The Sherlock Holmes one was funny. Yeah. I guess it is a low hanging fruit, but Gilgamesh is also low hanging fruit. He's arguably more low hanging fruit than Nero is. <laughs> um. The doctors all being submitted was also interesting. I don't know who sent that. No, you're right. I wouldn't marry Nero no matter what, unless uh, Minato was also in that pool. In that pool, in which case I would just marry Minato. Um. <laughs> but yeah, the Emiya group was very interesting. Muramasa Shiro Emiya, very fascinating submission. The third fleet, Ada Wan, Bayonetta one, also surprised me. Um, yeah, there were quite a bit. Oh my god! <laughs> you know, I'll I'll think about it. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna have to. I don't know if I'm gonna have time soon to dedicate to that because there's another game I want to get back to, but you know, we'll get back to that. We'll do it tournament style <laughs> next time <laughs> instead of having people submit groups. Gildir of Minato is mean, but <laughs> yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and save this and post it on Twitter. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and end the stream here for tonight, which is good timing, I think, because it sounds like everyone's just gotten home. But, yeah, thank you guys for coming. Thank you for the submissions. Um, I Aki just lost my mind laughing at some of these. Um, <laughs> yeah, thank you. I had a lot of fun, too. Um, I really enjoyed seeing what people submitted and what people like didn't submit out of my the characters they know I like. There were definitely characters I thought would end up on here that just did not show up other than Nero too so yeah. It is quite the list um but <laughs> it was very fun. I, I'll do something like this again sometimes. Not Maybe not soon, soon, but in the future. All right. Good night, everybody. Thank you for coming. Bye-bye.